it's uh, November 23rd. We're getting ready to wrap up our beehive. You can see we got our 15 pound felt paper. I'm gonna put a uh, top uh, honey super on there to give them a little ventilation up on top. See the bees are out a little bit today. It's about 50 degrees today. This is one of the few days that we've had where it's been 50 degrees now for three weeks. After today, we got mid 40s tomorrow and then dropping down into the 20s and 30s for a couple of weeks and it could be a long stretch before it gets warm enough to open this up again. So we're gonna wrap them up and then we're also gonna give them some granulated sugar here that I have mixed in here. We're gonna set that on top inside the hive and close it up. So I've taken the top off. You can see there's some activity here in the hive. The bees are milling around a little bit. That's a good sign. Okay, so the bees look pretty healthy at the moment. I can see some popping up out of here to look around. They're moving kind of slowly, of course, because it is only around 50 degrees. It's been pretty cold for a while. So this is our hole right here for ventilation. We're going to put the uh, sugar here on the opposite side. Okay, so this is nothing more than granulated sugar. We've dumped it in. Filled up a bunch in here to give the bees something to feed on. Uh, during the winter months, they already have stores of honey. This is just some additional food. They're just going to eat some of this granulated sugar and keep filling it into their honeycombs and everything. We are going to close up this lid now. We may have to pop in here every once in a while. Hopefully if we get warmer weather in a few weeks, we can add some more sugar in. But this is the simple setup we're going to try that this year. We're going to put our cover back on. Uh, and then we're going to wrap our uh, entire hive here. And uh, just leave them go. Hopefully they'll make it through the winter. So I've got my hive stapled. With the felt paper. There's a small little condensation escape hole up near the top. I'll maybe add a little bee landing strip onto that. It's already got this nice little overhang so I don't have to worry about snow falling on it. So that's kind of nice. And we'll just add a little bungee cord to wrap around my felt. Make sure it stays on there a little bit better. But hopefully the bees will do okay. So my bungees are intact here. Move that a little bit. That should keep the felt paper on there hopefully all winter long. So she's all wrapped up, got sugar inside, and uh, got the condensation hole. Lid seems good, so hopefully they'll do okay. We'll check on the sugar maybe in a few weeks and just dump some more in if we have to, if we get a nicer day where it's a little warmer.